Hi Destiny fans, welcome back to the channel. Today we will summarize the most insane weapon glitch in the history of Destiny that happened this weekend. And it's the best one since 2017 when we had a laser tag glitch in PvP. This weekend Bungie had oversight for the crafted weapon that allowed you to combine any weapon with any weapon frame. For example, you could craft an auto rifle with the aggressive shotgun frame, which would shoot shotgun pellets with the auto rifle speed and the distance. And it's not limited to shotgun frames. You can apply any frames to any weapons. Do you want a scout rifle to shoot as that messenger with the three grenades? No problems. And things went crazy after that with the different combinations providing insane DPS. The most popular crafted weapon was Emmet R2 with the aggressive shotgun frames. This was also the most popular weapon in Trials with 0.2 TTK. As you can see, each crafted weapon with the aggressive shotgun frame, instead of one arrow or bullet, generates several shotgun pellets instead that shoot at the long distance. The most insane DPS is coming from the grenade launchers or machine guns. Rocket launcher is supposed to be fun, but it kills you instantly. The remaining footage is the highlight of the crazy weekend playing different activities from the gambit to raids and dungeons. And believe me, PvP was busted. With 0.2 TTK and everyone using glitch weapon, it was a shit show. Everyone melts everybody. Also, expect to see a race of emblems for the different dungeon completions, solo and flawless. It was very easy to do these days. Interestingly, console's audience has less glitch crafted weapons because it was harder to do it on consoles than on PC. So a lot of people abuse the situation, crafting weapons on PC and then switching to the Gambit or PvP on the consoles. Bungie identified this issue within the same day, but they decided to let people have fun over weekend and the glitch has been fixed this Monday morning. And believe me, it was fun. So from today we are back to normal state and the game is looks as before. That was it for today and don't forget to like and subscribe if you like my content. Until next time.